Hey guys, I just wanted to share with you this really cool find I had made today at the Dollarama. Um, this... Oh. Okay. I set it on something flat. Okay, so it's a brush caddy and it was only $3. It's really cool. You've got holes all the way around here. Sorry, focus. Go ahead and focus, camera. Um... It may not focus. It's not, it's not ever worked right since I broke it. Um, but uh, yeah, there's holes all the way around to put your brushes in. And there's a handle on it right here. There's also this lifts out and you can put your paints or your inks in there. And a mixing tray there. And then that whole compartment lifts out and goes together separately. And uh, yeah, you can put your water in here and like little spots, grooves to lay your brushes in. And I'm not really sure. Uh, I guess, I guess you could, well, if you weren't worried about knocking it over like I just did because my water just went in here now since I knocked it over so I was gonna say maybe if you do small works of art you could like line them up in there maybe and like take this to go I guess I guess if you're moving it you'd want to dump the water out so that you didn't wreck your artwork but yeah I don't intend to do that anyways so I just thought it was really cool and I'm always I have my brushes usually here. I've got lots of brushes here in this caddy, but it's too far to reach from here to there. So I end up pulling out the brushes I want to use and laying them here. And then I don't have a lot of room and they're all rolling into my work and stuff. So I just saw it. And then I use, I've always got two different jars here, one with clean water and then one with the dirtier water. And I just thought this would be really cool, like eliminate the jars and eliminate the mess here from the brushes and I got two spots so clean water dirty water and all my brushes and yeah so three bucks I couldn't even believe it I just couldn't even believe it I went in there to buy one of those little round white plastic palettes because I got my inks that I just started using yesterday and I didn't have anywhere to mix them so I was just going to get one of those plastic palettes, but then this, I found this, and yeah, it's really awesome. I just couldn't even believe I got it at the dollar store. Maybe, maybe that's normal. Maybe you guys are laughing at me right now, but I don't care. It's awesome. So yeah, this is what I started with um, my new uh, Dr. Martin's Bombay India inks, which I totally love. They're so nice. They're really really nice like I really really love them and so I started this and it's gonna be hard to see because my camera is so shitty um but yeah she's throwing snowballs at the zombie giraffe in the Santa hat and uh all the background I did with the India inks that was the first time I've ever used them so I was just kind of playing around and having fun with it. Um, I'm going to probably just use Twinkling H2O's to finish off the grill. Um, and the, the zombie giraffe. But yeah, they're really awesome. I really like them. They, uh, they're permanent now, so all the work I did in the background is not going to run or anything when I add the watercolor to it. So it's, it's, yeah. And, and if you didn't see my Facebook post about this, uh, they're 100% vegan and cruelty free. So, and apparently all their art supplies are. All of everything they make at Dr. Martin's, they don't use any animal products in any of it. So. I wrote them and they confirmed that for me. Yeah, anyways, it's just going to be a short little video to show you my new brush caddy. Yay, you can get one at Dollarama 
I'm not being paid for this or anything. I just think it's really awesome. Anyways, bye.